Who the fuck are you? This is hardhead turf. And this is a bug. Hardheads? It's dinner time! Every time when you enter the map for the very first time, the name of the map remains on the middle screen. It's agonizing. Now we're gonna talk with him. We received a SOS message from Union Station to save someone. But it seems it's about my level. Way above my level. We can try once. If it's way too hard, I'll come back later. Denver is in a reach of my level right now. Then I should play Denver. Not this, but Denver. They even have a vehicle here. What am I supposed to do? Believe it or not, I've only done two maps in full so far. 30 hours for two maps. Now what's with this? Again, this fucking... I I'll freak out Who from this. I I'll literally you? freak out from this. This is hardhead turf. Desert Rangers. The Desert Ra- Wait a minute. Are you the guys who saved Fair and Vrigo from Sheriff Daisy Chain? Well, that was a hell of a ballsy move. Ah, but so what? You're dealing with the hardheads now. So tell me, what the fuck are you doing in our territory? These close-up conversations are the best thing in the game that they edit. We want to get inside that structure. Oh, 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 you mean our base? Well, the only way you get in there is if we stick a spit up your ass and cook you for dinner. And you know what? I think that's just what we're going to do. The six required. First aid seven. So let me write that shit down. I'm very sleepy. Hard as six. Uh, first aid seven. Kisses. What? Kisses five is available. Uh, 
why you're slumming here if you have the Gipper's stronghold? If you're going to chase them out, it's yours if you let us pass. Really? Ah, oh, don't give me that. Wait, you're going after the Gippers? Huh. Well, that changes things. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I gotta think. Okay, listen. We'll help you if we get to move into the Gipper's place once they're gone. Now, you promise us that, you got a deal. Otherwise, you're our next meal. Deal once the Gippers are gone, we don't care who lives there. You gotta let us into the station here and now. Damn it! You drive a hard bargain, but okay. Do what you need to do here and get out. Just don't think about double crossing us. So long, Rangers. Man, the amount of options this game gives you. Uh, hard as six, medic seven. Oh my god. Five, six, seven, eight points. Hardest six. Three, four, five, six. That's doable. Just so we can check that option too. It's not that big area, but there is underground for sure. They gave amazing amount of options for this thing also. There's the attack option, three conversation options to deal with this. And there's the morning star now. Professionally butchered. Barrels. If you decide to go straight for a fight. Uh, what did I say? Hard S6. Now let's check Hard S6. Questions for kid? No, I, I don't know. I don't regret a single decision because I tested my decisions, like I'm testing them right now. So no, I don't regret anything. Will I do it differently on the next playthrough? Yeah, to see all the outcomes. But I don't regret anything for sure. Because I usually play like this, you know, testing everything there is for every quest. Hardest six. Hardest six. Close. Confirm. And there was also Medic seven. I think someone has a lot of points. Medic seven. Four, five, 
five, six, seven, bam, close, confirm. We got both options now. Now let's see all outcomes. That's why I'm keeping skill points and not investing skill points, because I can see everything there is this way. And only this way. If you decide to spend all of your skill points, you're fucked. You're always gonna lack something. This way you can compensate always. You'll make something up. Six companions. Live like, I don't know, 10 skill points per companion. That's good enough to reach every skill check. I don't know what's Crusader Kings 3 at all. Nor do I plan to find out soon. I got this, I got Baldur's Gate 3, we got Cyberpunk. And I'll chill a bit with Who Sirius M4 when it's out. You? Doom Eternal this DLC. I don't know what to play first, to be honest. Ah, but what the fuck are you doing in our territory? Radio signal. Ho, ho, ho. You First aid. Kill us isn't gonna help well, you much. The only way you get in there is if we stick a spit up your ass and cook you for dinner. Shut up. By the look of those holes you in your what? face, you're days away from death I by think infection. That's just what we're gonna do. Hey, hardheads. Your boss is digging his own grave with his bullshit. Maybe you should run before he digs yours too. You're not scaring anyone with that noise. Ain't that you're not right scaring you? anyone and they're running around behind you. <laughs> Boys. <laughs> oh god damn it you chicken shits! Quit your blunder and kill these assholes! Okay, uh, you can make a fight a bit more fair like this. You can make the fight easier with hard ass. And now we're gonna check the med also. And then we've seen all options with him. So, you can make a deal with them. They let you pass. You eliminate Gibbers. They move in in Denver. Gibbers are in Denver. So, those crazy cannibals will move to Denver. If you make a deal with them. That's a very bad choice. If you ask me. There's a straight attack. Extremely difficult fight for Supreme Jerk. There is a tech where you can weaken them with hard ass. It's fucking hilarious how they run behind them. And now we're gonna see what happens with Matt. Why am I a hater? I'm not a hater, I just don't know what the game is. Fuck, I forgot to upgrade meds. Oh my god. Mm. Just to freak out from these loading screens. Don't enter. No. Who the f are you? This is Hardhead Turf. Hardheads? It's dinner time. By the way, I just realized now. There is no way I can fight him, he's got 45 armor. I was looking at health. And now I've seen the amount of armor he's got. There is no fucking way. Maybe you can do it on easier difficulties, not on Supreme Jerk, no. On a Supreme Jerk, maybe pass level 15, from 15 to 20. Maybe you can do something about it, but no. I'm level 11, there is no fucking way. Quest recommendation here is level 12. For Supreme Jerk, that's like at least 5 levels above. So this quest is like level 17 or so. 45 armor.
I nearly clicked on it again. The communism! Uh, these are communist robots, by the way. And they made them to be Russians. Communist robots. The communism. The communism means for communism. There's one final option to check here. Then I don't know what to do. I really don't like doing deals with these idiots. There's not a single normal faction in this entire game. Not a single one. They're all fucking maniacs, crazy, cannibals. Who the fuck are you? This is hardhead turf. Uh, what the fuck are you doing in our territory? Ho oh, ho ho. You mean our base? Kill us isn't gonna help you much by the look of those holes in your face. You're days away from bit of your death by infection. For dinner. Oh, go fuck yourself. Wait, you're, you're serious. <clears throat> you know, I, I, I have been feeling a little funny lately. That serious, those rest was are poisoning you. You need our help right now, but no deal unless you let us in. The station. Is that so? Oh, damn it! I knew I was sick. Okay, assholes. Fix me up, and you can do what you need to do. But we'll be watching you. Stink is gone. <laughs> so we finally know the way. The easiest way would be this one. When you level up, when you scale, you come back and you kill the fuckers, but not before that. This is the easiest way to go in. Now if they're on this level, what's the level of the actual maps in the dungeon? At least I know what's the requirement for the map. It's good to know. So we need med 7. I'm on meds 4. That means I can reach med 7 in 3 more levels. I should get those 3 levels in Denver and then I can come back here and do this quest. But not before that. So my personal guess is either Homestead or Denver. Homestead will give us a range jockey for our garage and for the vehicle. 